secret underground Cloud stream is dark and underground Bad secret underground Cloud stream is dark and underground Hello, <clears throat> hello, it's me, uh, Basil, Basil, uh, Basil Butler. Hello, hello, uh, Basil's, uh, it's Basil's secret, Basil's secret <clears throat> underground, secret underground, uh, uh, dark stream, that's what it's called, it's easy to remember. Uh, there you, go. Uh, you can see my fingers, look. So, oh, that shit! It looks like. Anyway, I do love. I do love, uh, I do love David Essex. No, uh, that's not going to fool anyone, is it? Down there. So that just uh, tidying up. Oh, hat's gone already. Hats, hats off already. Let's have a look who's in the uh, chatting thing. Thanks, thanks for, uh, uh, thanks, thanks for uh, watching. It's uh, I'm back in space. I've got, um, I've got, I've got the usual, but the other, the other parrot's back. The other parrot's back up there now, um, and uh, the uh, the the other parrot. Cause I've got two parrots now. And uh, the beavers, the beavers are uh, happy. He's got some uh, Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts turned up, and uh, and well, mind you, the uh, over the other side, the fox, the fox and the owl and the potatoes, uh, just the uh, same as usual. Happy as Larry, they are. Hello, hello, uh, hello, Mission Control. Mission Control helps keep the uh, keeps the light going, uh, and so does uh, so does that round thing. As long as that's doing that, then everything's all right. Uh, hello, Eddie Brizo. Dark and underground, and dark and underground. Exactly. Uh, Eddie Brizo. Hello, uh, hello, hello. Uh, uh, whoever I said hello to. JC Escapades. Uh, hello, hello. Josie Ray. Hello, Josie Ray. Harry Norman. Harry Norman. Eddie Brizo says um, David Essex is staring into my soul. He's staring into everyone's soul, David Essex. Eyes, incredible eyes. Oh, I could go on and on about David Essex. It's that, uh, especially back in the seventies uh, and eighties. If you see, if you see f uh, footage of him uh, then, the films, the films he made around then, oh, he's got such charisma, uh, a sparkle in his eyes, cheeky little grin, uh, amazing. Uh, 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 Harry Norman says, "How is everyone? How is everyone? Pretty good, thanks. Uh, one one day till the weekend," says Josie Ray. Go in the chatting box. Everyone's having a lovely uh, in the chatting. Uh, not sure what it is really. Chatting quadrant. Chatting. Uh, chatting sphincter. Harry Norman's doing well, thank you. Can't wait for the weekend. Unfortunately, I'm on my own in the office tomorrow, apart from my bosses. So it will be a long, slow day. That sounds terrible. Poor Harry Norman's going to have a horrible day tomorrow, by the sounds of it. 
Hello, Eyes on Legs. Good evening. Good evening, Eyes on Legs. Uh, uh, good evening to... Who have I said good evening? Becky Miz. Hello, Becky Miz. Oi, oi, she says. Uh, everyone's saying hello. It's very friendly. It's a very friendly uh, place uh, most of the time. Not always. Got the occasional uh, nutcase turns up, but... Everyone's everyone's having a lovely time. Hello, um, have I said what? Oh, and uh, Barty Fuff, Fuffkin. Hello, Barty Fuffkin. Um, uh, thank you for joining in. It's uh, everyone's having a lovely time. Having a lovely time in the old, uh, whatever you call it, chatting thing. Just have a just have a sip of tea, and a cup of tea. Got the uh, cup with the uh, fox and the, uh, the the elephant and the uh, worm and the. Uh, and the uh, pop-up toaster. Mm. Yes, Josie Ray. Both parrots on board. The other one's turned up over there. 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 Uh, he's up there now. He's quite happy. Basil, a regular Dr. Doolittle of space. Yes, uh, I suppose so. Yeah, I, I, uh, I don't mind a few passengers. I don't mind people as well. I just, I, unfortunately, just keep getting uh, parrots and uh, and uh, foxes and uh, beavers and owls. Got the robot, of course. Oh, got the little robot. Another robot down here. Let's have a. Where is he? Here he is. How's it? How's it going? What's it like being a? What's it like being a robot? Rather, well, usually, usually quite chatty, but camera shy. I think you know. He knows that uh, he's on Twitch. He's off. He's off. He got. Uh, it wasn't comfortable. Uh, anyway, he's a uh, he's a uh, he's, he's company of sorts. Uh, let's have a look. So, quick, quick look at the old chatting. Uh, what's it? Uh, parrots. Uh, the little. I love his face. I'm not sure whose face. Probably the robot. Uh, that was uh, Harry Norman. Harry Norman loves the face. Uh, got a big gob that robot. Says Eddie Bruzzo. He has a kind, uh, a kind face, like Christopher, the Serie Norman. Yes, probably. You could say that. Anyway, we're going to have a relaxing, a relaxing evening. Uh, well, not evening, won't be that long. be only for an hour or something, I don't know. Um, yeah, we're going to make it relaxing tonight. Uh, uh, everyone should relax. This is just relax. It's nearly the end of the week. I'm jealous that you've met... Uh, there you go. Uh, I'm getting uh, I'm getting very tired. I'm getting very very I'm getting very very uh many times as you ate for dinner. Very very tired. Very very tired. I'm sure I'm going to fall asleep any any second. Uh, any second now I'm I'm going to uh, what's that say? I want to be I want to relax. Relax, uh, Jesse Fresh. Relax. Uh, Eddie Brizo, Christopher's not always kind. It must be said he has his own uh, Yes, I'm going to sleep. Nodding off. I'm very, really, really, uh, really, really tired. <laughs> Man. 
I snipped your wires, creamy boy. I've infiltrated your mainframe. I've hacked your little roundy roundy thing. I've slithered my way into your tube base. Now you're going to die. universe together. I will build you a new, tighter, shinier, spacesuit. Fabulous. Uh, well, Oh, what happened? Oh, I had a nightmare. Hampton nightmare. Hat, hat fell off nightmare. Oh dear. Um, terrible nightmare. Christopher Robot is going to kill me and turn me into a robot. And then we were going to, two of us, arm in arm, arm in arm, we were going to kiss and uh, cuddle and then, and then take over the universe, destroy everything in our path. Uh, 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 so just a quick look, quick look at the chatting box. See if I missed, see what I missed while I was asleep. Terrible uh, nightmare. Uh, uh, bloody hell. Uh, uh, let's have a quick look. Uh, is this Basil's dream sounds? Yes, Wolf Lord. Is that, uh, that's what it was. Wolf Lord, are we in uh, uh, his dream? Are we even real? Says Josie Ray. That's a good point. Oh, Christopher, you naughty uh, boy. Says Harry Norman. I'm not sure anymore. Is this a wet one? Says uh, Wolf Lord. Intense, says Josie Ray. Weirdly, I want to fall asleep to this, says Josie Ray. But it's very, very weird. Uh, uh, frightening. Frightening, uh, says Eddie Breeze. Uh, Ag Aga Laura Dora uh, 00728 uh, says, uh, uh, brilliant, absolutely brilliant, says it in, in a weird language. Wolf Lord, I wonder if there's a world record for the tightest spacesuit. Oh, I'd like to see a tight, a tight spacesuit contest, uh, and uh, I'd like to judge one. I like, actually, I actually wouldn't judge it. I want, I want to take part in it. I'd love to. I'd love to take part in the the tightest uh, spacesuit competition. Phew, glad it was just a nightmare. Chris is such a lovely yet troubled young robot. Yes, he is. Uh, Christopher Robot sent sent me that sent me that um, recording that I just played. That's thanks to Christopher Robot for that uh, for that. Sorry, just having a, just having a scratch again. Uh, I got I got fleas, space fleas. Uh, that's not, could be alien fleas. It's a bit of worry. Uh, what, what, should do, what should we do tonight? We can have uh, we can have some uh, quarter chat. Although I don't know what the point of quarter chat is because it's just a. Uh, just chatting anyway, aren't we? Just chatting anyway, really. Fox fleas. Good point, Eddie Brizo. Probably off that bloody fox. Maybe the parrots have some sort of mite. Yeah, could be. Could be. Um, uh, well, there's always the there's always the uh, the beaver and the owl. Uh, two more suspects. Or there could be little bugs hiding between the uh, sprouts or potatoes. It, it could be coming from anywhere. Who knows? Space in, don't mention space invaders, Harry Norman. Uh, uh, enough trouble with, with those uh, uh, buggers. What's that? The, uh, fly, the flies uh, flies back. He's, uh, sorry, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's not on my screen. He's probably on yours. Oh, there he goes. He's off. He's off. Flying around. He's big, he's big as a parrot. Massive flies you get in there, just near the moon. The flies are huge. Gone. <sighs> we could play a bit of a. I got the got the game that I played. We played the other day, if you saw. The the cat game. Uh, the, living the life of a living the life of a cat, a stray cat. Uh, might have another go at that. Right, Christmas dinner. 
owl or parrot? No, no, I'm just the uh, I'm a vegetarian, uh, so so we'll all be we'll all be uh, joining in uh, eating the um, potatoes and sprouts if they if if I'm not sure what the sell by date is on those sprouts. I think in space things don't go off. I'm not sure if that's scientifically proven, but that's my theory. Uh, and I should know. I'm in I'm in space. Uh, let's have a quick look at the um, parasite scan. Oh, mission control. Uh, computer parasite detected. Uh, fetus pubis. What's that? Is that uh, pubic lice? Have I got uh, scabs or a uh, scab? Where do you get down there? The owl and the fox have also had to learn to be vegetarian. This is early breeze. Oh, yes. Yes. I do. Crabs. Oh, crabs. Yes, maybe it's the crabs. Crabs in my. Uh... Can you get the crabs in, in your head? Uh, hey crabs. So we could play we could play the cat game. Can play back back to playing the cat. Or um, what else have we got? Got the uh, um, foot crabs could be. Oh yeah, I've still got I've got a bad foot. My foot is still bad. Jason Jason plays likes the cat game. Let's uh, let's go and the uh, let's go and find the cat game. Uh, here, this it's here somewhere. In the fun pod. Here we go. It's all fun in the fun pod. Time for the game. <coughs> Who's Bob? Uh, um, uh, I must have. Uh, I must have missed the cat game. Oh, you're in for a treat then, there, Norma. It's unbelievable. Who's Bobby's music? Who's Who's uh, Bobby? Bob music. Sorry, Bob's uh, checking out Ryan again. Uh, is that Ryan Reynolds? I've no idea. Yes, Ryan Reynolds is uh, there, and. Uh, and Bob Marley's enjoyed himself, which I, uh, I'm very pleased about. Let's get the cat game uh, going then. Uh, I had it a second ago. There it is. Bobby Chant made fairground organ music. Bobby Chant, Bobby Chant is very, very talented. So, uh, I've, got to, I've got to get you to the uh, iPad. There we are. There's the, uh, there's the, buddy, there's the buddy cat again. I think I sound better to work this. Yep, no, that right. way. There's our cat. Come on, turn around. You don't want to turn around that way. Right, let's go for it. Let's have a walk about. Let's push a bin over if we can. We have to, we have to, I don't know what we do. It's just uh, surviving, surviving on the streets. That's it. So, feline joy activated. It's not a, uh, it's not a complicated game. Mostly pushover dustbins. What was that? Try and work out how to control it. Oh, there's something that fell out. Eat that. Little snack. I want to see you devour some squirrels today, is it Eddie Brizo? Yes, this this uh Yeah, I've got to, I've got to defeat three squirrels. Eat three apples. Apparently mark my territory. Let's do a bit of marking now. Squirt. Yeah, mark just mark that spot. It's always raining, and it's usually dark as well. Let's go and find a squirrel. Oh, hang on. Uh, pause. Pause the uh, hello, who's 
calling, please? Hello? Hello, who's calling, please? RSB, Dr. Go turn this off soon. I just wanted to say I'm about to start streaming, and I'm much better at you. I didn't even, uh, I didn't even catch his name. I got this, got this, this, distracted, but... Distracted for no good reason. Now what's going on? Is that the cat? Is that uh, something happened to the cat? Hang on. Uh, let's, uh, let's get... Sorry about that. Here we are. That was a waste of time, that court. Doctor Who? Is it Doctor Who? Yeah, my dream is coming back, Eddie Rizzo. You're, you are quite correct. Anyway, let's, uh, let's just watch the traffic for a little while. Contemplating suicide. Look right, look left. Look right. Oh, wrong way, it's really too much. Look round, look behind you. Look left. Look right. Look left. Go back a bit. Look right. Look left. Run. Or oh, just walk. Made it, across the road. Uh, hello, uh, who's there? Let's have a quick look. Swivel cat, yeah, swivel cat. Good evening, uh, Matt Davis. Shall, shall we all raid and phone in and, and say that he's ship? Yeah, I didn't, I didn't catch who it was, Harry Norman. If, if you know who it is, well, uh, yeah, why, why not raid him? Um, hello, hello, uh, Matt Davis. Thanks, thanks for uh, just playing the cat game. It's across the road. Uh, I'm, going to try, I'm going to try and find a squirrel. Let's, uh, let's, let's run back across the road without even checking. Don't even look. Just go for it. Oh. Indestructible. That's one of his lives gone. Oh, some dustbins. No, I think we've been here already, haven't we? Let's go this way anyway. Let's try and find a squirrel. Let's get one squirrel at least. Here he goes. Oh, there's something down there. What's that? Is that a squirrel? Oh, it's, a, it's a rat. I think it's a rat. Oh, that rat's too quick. Oh, he has got a run feature, hasn't he? Had oh, shit. Just realised he's got a thing where it makes him run. Oh, left, left. Where's he gone? Oh, shit, we lost it. Stop running. Lost control of the cat. The cat has got swag. The cat has got swag. Swag. He's not got. He's not got a. What's that over there? Run again. Let's try and creep up on it. Stealth. Stealth mode. Stealth mode. Come on. Dinner. Oh yes. My final scream as he uh, as we uh, murdered it. Murdered the rat. Can we eat it now? Now we can push it about. Eat it. Eat. There we go. Gone. Yum yum. Sorry, it wasn't a squirrel. It's getting dark now. Oh, the squirrels are going to go to bed. How are we going to get a fucking squirrel in the dark? Mark your territory. Good point. Let's go and uh, mark by this wall. Lovely. Let's do a couple, couple of extra ones. Uh, don't know where we're going now. It's, uh, pitch black. Piss on it. What's that? Is that a squirrel? A bird. 
Oh. It's a fox. Let's creep up on it again. Let's do another stealth. Whatever it is. It's not a squirrel. Oh, it's fucked off. Forget the stealth. It's gone. Oh! Went that way. I think it was a cat. It's not a squirrel anyway. Please urinate on the lamppost. Oh, there's one of these poles here. Let's have a... They don't let you turn... Um... You can't turn your bum to it, though. I tried that before. Best you can get is sort of sideways. Go past it. Maybe back up a bit. No. You can't reverse... You can't reverse onto these poles. Come on. Oh, nearly. No, wrong way. No. Of course, like trying to reverse a trailer. Oh, he dropped dead. Dropped dead. Hello, uh, uh, Jess Cordell. Looks like I haven't missed much. I haven't missed much. You've missed an incredible uh, game of cat. Uh, was he thirsty? Uh, I think he was probably. I, I wasn't. I wasn't paying attention. I was just just trying to piss up a lamppost, and uh, that's what happens. Let's go across the road. You won't, you won't walk in a straight line. Ooh, dicing with death. There's another life gone. Oh, there's a greyhound. Never going to catch that. Look, it's gone. There it goes. There it goes. Let's run after it. Let's see how we can let's see if we can keep up. For, oh, I can't get up the pavement. Come on. Chase that greyhound. Oh, it's gone. There he is. Fuck me, they're fast. They're faster than the Greyhound. Oh, I ran into a brick wall. Yeah. Too, uh, a little bit too quick there. Anyway, it was an uh, excellent, excellent uh, competition. Greyhound just about uh, one, I suppose. That looked like a foal. Did it? I think it was a Greyhound. Hi, Hall. Hi, hi all, says Jess Cordell. How are we? We're having a lovely time uh, looking for a squirrel. Aha! There's one in the road. How are we going to get this? Stealth. Is oh, I think the I think oh, I can't fucking see him now. Oh God knows where it's gone. Freaking up the tree. Take this bloke. It's hard to see. It. Once it gets dark, it's really hard to see. Let's attack this man. Come on, get him. This is a bad cat. <laughs> Piss. Quick piss. Scratch the man. Do a piss. Um, nothing else to do now. It's too dark to see what you're doing now. Stormy night. Let's go over by the building. No, oh, it's a. Let's get that crow. Got it. Can't see if we've killed it or not. Yeah. Can't see any sign of it. Is it there? No idea. Lost it. Right, it gets too dark at night this game, it's ridiculous. Can you see him with a flash of lightning? I don't know where we're going now. Bite. Bite what? The ground. Bite, bite, bite. Uh, 
Well, I think I might have to call it a day with this. It's too dark to see what's going on. Anyway, that's the latest adventures. It is brighter in the middle of the town, maybe, is it? Where's the middle of the town? Look at him go. I don't know where he is. More please. Uh, running around. Can you turn the iPad brightness up? I wish I could. This, this is as bright as it goes. It's ridiculous. You, you cannot stop until you've successfully pissed on a tree, please. The Josie Ray. Hello, uh, Emma. Hello, Emma. Uh, sorry, the uh, game is it's far too dark. It's night time, it's stormy. All oh, these bushes are nice and bright. Any marks of daisies? Oh, it's gone to... Too dark. It is too dark. You're right. He's in the road now, I think. Yeah, there's a white line. Go for a little run in the dark in the storm. Stop for a piss. Off again. I suppose it's, uh, it's a secret dark stream, but this is the wrong type of dark, perhaps. Yes, I think you're right, Jessica. Jessica the it's, uh, it's a disastrous game. I think I might have to find another game for next time. Unless if you could turn off night time, so we could see what's going on. Little point playing it, really. Can't see anything. Yeah, can't, cats aren't supposed to be able to see in the dark. This one can't. Just waiting for the die now, really, so I can uh, call it a day. Pissing and floating. Let's give them. It's not for a piss. There we are. Quick piss. Yeah, I should have. I should have made straight. Straight for the river. Is it getting lighter? It's brightening up. snowing. It's a bloody snowstorm now. This cat's having no luck. What was that? He goes there. Where's he gone? Oh, I saw a squirrel. Please find a gold tree spot. Quick, let's go and find a tree. tree around here somewhere. There's a tree. There we are. Let's have a piss up this tree. No. Nope. Got a back up. Back him up to it. Wrong way. Oh, he's died. He's died again. Didn't get to the tree quick enough. Cat's dead. Let's go back to the bump pod. Oh dear. Poor old. Uh, poor old cat.
Rumpel. F-U-N, fun. I'm dancing and crying, says uh, Jazzy Ray. Uh, anyway. it's a, yeah, I forgot to mention before, it's a call-in. Uh, it's a call-in. Uh, where is it? There we are. It's, it's on the screen. Pardon me. You can call in. If you want to call in, It's someone did, didn't they? Um, lovely call. Uh, Skype, you can Skype me, Skype Magic Butler, or call 020-3287-1213. Or you can go on the guest ecam thing. And uh, and you can appear on the screen. You can appear in the spaceship with me. You can you can watch that. You can watch that uh, close up. Have a good look at that go around. Look at all the other dogs there. There's three more little ones there. Uh, vital, all of it. What's the time? What's the time? Quarter ten. Anyway, sorry about the cat. That was um. Uh, maybe I'll just uh, play it when it's daytime. I mean, in the game, not on the, not in the. Uh, just see what else we got there. Let's have a. Anyone fancy? Anyone fancy a uh, story? Should we have a more fucking cat? No, no cat now. No cat. Having a break from the cat. It's too bloody dark. Could see. Could see no cat. Let's. Uh, let's do. Anyone fancy story time? Make up a story. Let's all make up a story. You, you, uh, you, uh, I, you, um, you tell me all the characters. No story, cat. You tell me all the characters, and uh, you tell me the um, uh, plot, the plot, and the characters. Give me names, uh, places, uh, ideas, anything you like. Yeah, you do all that, and I'll uh, join it all together and I'll make up a live story, a story written by all of us together here in space. Uh, um, yeah, let's, let's do that. Yeah, it's time. It's time for a story. Let's make up a story. You've got the time, I've got the story. If you've got the story, I've got the time. Story time. Yes, it's the mouth of fucking story time. Story time. There we are. So, just to prove it. Story time. There, so like, yeah, I do. Story time. Story time. If you, so, if you want to, um, if you want to uh, uh, help me create a story, if you type in, uh, I tell you what, if you if you go into the chatting uh, box and if you use the um, highlighter, highlight your message. If you highlight your message, please highlight. Oh, it says so there. Mission control says highlight my message. If you highlight your message, then I'll know it's a. Uh, 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 a suggestion for the uh, or a bit uh, uh, of the uh, story. Uh, Waff Lord says Ronald Weisberger. Is that is that um, right? Looks like it looks like it's, it's part of the story there. And uh, once upon a time, yes, once upon a time. Let's start the story then. Once upon a time, it's nineteen uh, seventy-seven. It's nineteen seventy-seven. Uh, it was a lovely summer's day, and there was this. A uh, cat. It was this cat? A stray cat. It was a stray cat. Um, it used to belong somewhere, but it got. Sh but they moved. 
and he got left behind. Uh, his name was Ronald Wiesberger. The, the cat was named Ronald Wiesberger. And uh, <clears throat> the cat, the cat, haven't, haven't, he's, he's managing to survive all right in the wild. Uh, then one day he's wandering around, uh, he's a bit lonely, and he finds an old womble. An old womble, and he's attracted to the womble instantly. Instantly, uh, uh, instantly attracted to the womble. A mission control operative gone rogue. Yes, absolutely, absolutely, uh, absolutely uh, fell in love. Fell in love with the Womble. Uh, this is a character named indeed. Well, the uh, uh, yes, uh, uh, Ronald, Ronald, uh, Ronald Weisberg, that was his name. Ronald, Ronald, just call him Ronald, I think. Just called him Ronald. He fell in love. He fell in love with a Womble, and uh, he lived. Keep up, dude. He lived. He lived on the uh, on the world. He lived in the world. He was a part of the world. Of course, he was a part of the world. Uh, the cat. Uh, something involved. And uh, yeah, so so he fell in love with this uh, Ronald and the Womble. They were known around the town after a while as here comes Ronald and the Womble. You know, they were they were went around everywhere together. Uh, and one day. Uh, they were walking, uh, taking a shortcut across the field, and uh, they trod in, trod in something. Uh, uh, and Ronald said, "What's what's that?" And uh, the Womble said, uh, oh, "It's uh, it's a rotten turnip. It's a rotten turnip." And uh, this this story is really struggling, isn't it? Uh, I'm going to go back to the cat in a minute. Um, it's a rotten, it's a rotten turnip. And uh, he said, well, I'm going to clear it up because I'm a Womble. So he clears it up, puts it in his uh, pocket. And uh, they, they, uh, they spot a mushroom. Hang on, what's it? Uh, yeah, they spotted the mushroom. And they, they ate the mushroom. And uh, they, they, it, was, it, was a, uh, it was a magic mushroom. And they, they, they had hallucinations and uh, all sorts of weird things. Uh, they rolled about. They rolled about on the ground. And they they licked each other's feet and uh, and dribbled. Uh, and then they they sort of came to after a while. The effects of the mushroom wore off. And uh, then they uh, the Womble got got the uh, mushroom. They got not the mushroom. Got the turnip. Got the got the turnip out of his uh, pocket. He got the turnip out of his pocket. So sorry for, for repeating that. It's just uh, it's not because I'm trying to give myself time to think. It's just that I just like repeating things. Uh, uh, anyway, got the rotten <laughs> rotten turnip out of his pocket, and uh, so they, were, they were very close to London, uh, just on the outskirts, and uh, property prices were very expensive. So so the cat and the uh, the cat and the Womble, they made their home inside the rotten turnip because it was fucking huge turnip. I don't know how he got it in his pocket, but they they sort of spread it out and then they um, got a massive rolling pin and like a bit of a pasta so, and they uh, spread it all out, pastry rather, like a bit of pastry. Spread it all out and then uh, waited for the sun to make it go hard and then they uh, s sawed it into planks and uh, made a house. Because they couldn't afford London prices. Um, uh, Wimbledon wanted to go on holiday, but the cat. Yes, the uh, the, the the Womble, the Wimbledon the Wimbledon Womble, the Wom the Womble wanted to go um, on holiday. They they've been happy living in the in the London Park, South London Park, inside the wooden uh, turnip uh, house. Uh, but the Womble got bored, ironing and just going to the shops, um, picking up litter, constantly picking up litter. Uh, he wanted to go on, wanted to have a holiday. Uh, the cat said, "Yeah, let's go on holiday." But but but, but the um, Womble wanted to go, go litter picking in uh, Mallorca, and the cat the cat's scared of flying. And he's also scared of trains, and he's scared of cars and boats. Um, uh, so they were sitting there feeling a bit sorry for themselves 
and then the um the um the Womble said said um I don't think life can get much worse than this. This is uh, miserable. And then suddenly, Ryan Reynolds, the, uh, the famous actor, turns up, uh, pulls a chainsaw out, and he starts to attack their little uh, rotten turnip wooden house they made with a the chainsaw. Uh, they, they run screaming out into the park. Doesn't it annoy you when people don't pick up their rotten turnips or worse by them in the... Uh, turn it thing. Yes, yes. Uh, meant womble. Uh, yes, it does. It's very annoying. Everyone gets annoyed in this story when um, people don't pick up their rotten turnips uh, or throw their rotten turnip bags into a hedge. Yes, everyone's uh, uh, livid about that. All through the story. Um, but Ryan Reynolds is sawing down their house with the uh, with the chainsaw, uh, <coughs> and. Uh, the cat made a womble hide from his friend as the cat. The cat made the womble hide from his friend as the cat was quite protective. Now the nation is my lord. All right, so the cat at this point, I'm going to read this out. At this point, the um, uh, Ryan Reynolds, is, they've, they've legged it. Like Ryan Reynolds has went berserk, chopped the house up and uh, and uh, went then rolled about in, in all the um, sawdust and... Um, Took his clothes off, and then eventually he was arrested. Um, but it's put it put the cat and the wobble right off living in that. They, they thought they'd try a different area. Uh, the cat made the wobble hide from his friends, as the cat was quite overprotective because it had never been in a relationship and didn't want the wobble to see other people. So the poor old wobble, he's uh, he's uh, he's, he's uh, days going from bad to worse. All of a sudden, uh, a, a postman comes along. He says, "Are you the? Uh, is that? Is are you the? Um, what's his name? Oh shit! I forgot the bloke's name. Um, the cat's name. Uh, Ronald. Ronald, wasn't it? Ronald the cat and uh, and the uh, Womble. He says, "Are you Ronald and Womble?" And they, they say, "Yes, we are." He says, um, "Here's a letter for you." They won the competition. They've won the competition. He calls it back up from the flumps. I. I uh, um, but then uh, Ryan Reynolds is, is coming after him again. But they, they get on a special phone and they call for backup from the flumps. Uh, I love the way you cleverly weaved that into the story. I don't know what I weaved into the story. Uh, Mitt Ronald Weisberger. Uh, 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 where were, where were we? Ron, Ronald Weisberger, that's, uh, just, uh, just to remind you, that's the name of the cat. The, the, flumps, the flumps came to the rescue and... Uh, and uh, the prize, the prize that they won, that we're so excited about, was a uh, an all expenses paid trip to the local turnip factory. Struggle detected, says uh, Mission Patrol. Um, when they got when they got to the uh, when they when they got to the uh, turnip factory, because they uh, were very excited, they thought we could get a big one and make another house. Uh, but they got to the front door, and and the woman that was uh, going to given the tour of the factory, was the um, blonde lady from the Brotherhood of Man. Uh, and uh, and that's just about the end of the story. Uh, they, they, uh, they both fell in love with the, with the blonde woman from Brotherhood of Man, and then they, they uh, moved in together. They, they, they got all the turnips. They, they, they talked her into letting them, and they, they letting them have the turnips. They took all the turnips, uh, and they made the biggest, like a, like a castle out of... Um, out of squashed turnips uh, on top of a mountain, and they lived up there, the three of them, and they had freeway sex uh, all the time, uh, shagging each other like my uh, cat and the turnip, uh, and the cat and the uh, womble, and the blonde lady from Brother the Man. Freeway sex for for years and years, and they and uh, no one knows what happened to them after that because because um, uh, it the, uh, got dark. Uh, and that's the end of the story. That's uh, thank you very much. That was uh, that was uh, was a very 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 poor um, uh, story time. Story time.
Let's make up a story. You've got the time, I've got the story. If you've got the story, I've got the time. Story time. my hat take evasive action I did take evasive action crikey Becky Miss says uh, crikey <coughs> crikey indeed what's the time is it uh, what should we do next just uh, I don't think I play the cat again because it's too bloody dark. This is this it's going to be night time next time I play it. I'll wait till it's daytime. I think I play the cat again. Have a sip of tea. One small step for man. One giant leap for man. Bombastic sound. Hello, bombastic sounds. Thank you for um. Thank you for following bombastic. It's a uh, very very good of you. Follow follow and. Uh, Go in the uh, chatting area and, uh, and say hello. Everyone, everyone in there is in there, and uh, and I'm sure they'll love to. Oh, love to talk with them. Uh, hey, dude, love your outfit. Thank you very much. I've got a hat, shirt, t-shirt. With a, it's got a like a zombie bunny, like a zombie bunny, and uh, t and uh, oh, there you are. Welcome to well, welcome to. Uh, Basil's secret dark, uh, secret underground dark stream. I think it's called. Right, should, I thought maybe, maybe uh, just do. Um, I've made the bloody song for it, and I keep playing it. Call to chat. Zombunny. Let's do a bit of call to chat before we go. Uh, it's not really a game. Just uh, play it. Play a very long introduction. Call to chat. Uh, say do you want to chat. No one wants to chat, and then uh, say good night. What's the plan? Slip into my cockpit and pick yourself a hat 
It doesn't really matter cause it's really cool to chat It's cool to the chat Cool to chat, it's cool to chat. Um, right, let's uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look if it's uh, let's have some let's have some cool chat. Um, oh, by the way, I did a I did a did a spree cushion. Some of you, thank you very much if, for for um, listening. Those of you who did did a spree show. Uh, like the old days, I haven't done one for months and months and months and months. Uh, did a spree show. Uh, it was good fun. Played a couple of silly games, played some songs, and uh, and uh, finally enjoyed it. So I'll be doing I'll be doing uh, more Spreaker as well as doing this. In fact, Spreaker's much more relaxing. It's laid back Spreaker. Laid back. Haven't got to worry about controlling the uh, parrots and things, uh, and space invaders, and flying a flying a spaceship. Just relax, and um, relaxing time. Um, so if, if you'd like a mute, if you'd like if you've got a song you want played, put it in my Discord, and I'll, uh, I'll ne on next time I do a Spreaker show, put it in my dis Discord, and I will um, play it. Well, I won't, I won't, won't uh, if I don't like it. If I like it, I'll play it. Uh, anyway, it's cool to chat. It's cool to chat. Let's have a look. See anyone's asked me any questions. Basil Eddie Breezo says, Basil, do you dream in colour or black and white? Uh, colour, very very vivid colour. Like Technicolor, like like the '60s uh, films or '50s, whenever it was, spectacular, vivid colours. That's it. I don't know if that's good or bad. What's that say about me? Nothing probably. Basil, do you relate to John Tracy from Thunderbirds, the one stuck in space while everyone uh, else was having fun? Yes, yes, I do. Uh, I tell you, I tell you, I, um, there's a character in Thunderbirds. I think it was just one one episode. He was a, he was in a spaceship and he was I think he was a, a disc jockey they called a disc jockey uh, in in the, in 1960s he was a 1960s space uh, spaceship disc jockey and his name was Rick O'Shea and he used to go Rick Pew O'Shea on the uh, on his little um, thing uh, and I think he got trapped in I think Spunderbird had to go and rescue Rick O'Shea. Because uh, his spaceship uh, all went wrong, it was uh, excellent. But yeah, I, 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 yeah, I love a bit of Thunderbirds. The proper one with puppets. I like the puppets. I'd like to have some puppets. Uh, I, can, I just confess that openly. Matt Davis, Basil, what's the worst thing you've ever smelt? Worst thing I've ever smelt. Um, oh, there's lots of possibilities here. So I don't know what exactly what the word. One one I remember well. Uh, I, I had a cat, um, and he got a uh, got a lump on his head. Got a lump there. I think he had a fight with another cat, and uh, 
got this lump and uh, the top of the top of his there between his up, nose up there and the top there you feel it through the fur it got it got bigger and bigger so I took him to the vet I thought it's not going it's not getting better I have to go to the vet so I went to the vet and the vet looked at it and he said that's an abscess I think it was an abscess anyway it's, it's it gone there uh, horrible in there and the vet the vet um just made he pulled a bit of fur away and he made a little hole and then he and then it just burst uh, this greeny grey green uh, stuff came out and uh and then he passed out and the smell was the worst of one of the uh, worst one of the welsh worst not welsh worst smells uh, i've ever smelt uh, cat wasn't cat was fine afterwards uh what was the what was the first pizza you, you ever ate what was uh just a margarita uh, probably something like that what was the first per pizza you ever saw? It was probably the one that I was eating, uh, the, the margarita. What was the last VHS video you rented? Oh, fuck if I know. Uh, um, I can't, uh, yeah, i would forgotten that I ever did rent uh, videos, did rent them for once. Um, it would have been something like, uh, uh, probably, uh, oh, I don't know. Probably um, Arnold Schwarzenegger or something like that. I I already I got no idea. Coke or Pepsi? I'd have to say uh, I'm not really fast. Coke probably. That's what you usually get. Basil, what's the first last thing you can remember? Uh, last thing I remember was saying something about Coca-Cola. The first thing I remember uh, was uh, uh, breaking my arm when I was about three. Uh, I've broke. I've broke. Um, I've been very accident prone. When I was a boy, I was uh, I was a tomboy boy. I was a boy, but also a tomboy. What's a tomboy? What's a boy who's a tomboy? Like a tom tom boy. I was a tom tom boy, and uh, I'd climb up trees and uh, jump off them, and, uh, and all sorts. Run, run about, run about, swing on things, fly through the air. Anyway, I broke I broke this arm three times. I broke this arm twice. Uh, I broke. Um, that's what I broke. Broke both wrists. Broke my right knee. Uh, broke my oh, I broke my left uh, shoulder. Broken all my toes on one foot and one toe on the other foot. Uh, I think that's it. Anyway, so uh, breaking things is a uh, is a uh, second nature. Barely got anything left that I haven't uh, broken. Uh, Basil, oh, well, I'm missing the out. What's the last thing you remember? Uh, Basil, what's the best question to ask you? Uh, uh, oh, bugged if I know. What's the best question? Uh, one that comes from your heart. Uh, or um, if you could be, Jessica Space says, if you could be a, any dead celebrity, who would you be? I would be David Bowie. I would come back as David Bowie, and I would, uh, and I would sing. Uh, I would sing. There's a star man waiting in the sky, uh, etc. Uh, uh, Jess Cooldale, Basil, chat about your first stand-up gig. My first stand-up gig. Um, what was the first one? Fucking hell, that's a long time ago. For the first, the first few uh, times I did a stand-up gig, had had um, had skin. I had skin instead of cardboard, and uh, wasn't at all happy about it. I didn't enjoy it at all. Oh, Cole, uh, following Cobby Soul. Cole Cobby Soul is following. Thank you very much for following. I don't know why they got that alert. Uh, I mean, not. Your alert, but the alert with the, the uh, it doesn't matter. Different pictures of what I usually get. It seems to be it seems to be doing its own thing. The alerts. Uh, stand up, stand up gig. Uh, yeah, I, I did some uh, looking quite different. Didn't have the hat either. I don't think. I don't think I had the hat or these. Uh, and um, yeah, it wasn't very. It wasn't very good. It wasn't very good at all. Uh, 
I remember at the, I remember at the, uh, one gig I went to, it mostly it was, uh, I went to a couple of gigs in pubs where it was just a lot of uh, open mic comedians all, um, and, and uh, do it like a dozen, dozen doing five minutes each. And then, and we were also our own audience. So it was just ridiculous. It was just a waste of time. Um, and I uh, didn't really enjoy it. And you usually, tra usually travel about two hours to get somewhere to do five minutes. Uh, get hardly any laughs and then another two hours to get home again. Uh, um, but, but I finally enjoyed it uh, some of the times. Um, one, gig, one gig I did and uh, to about a dozen people. Uh, did, did a couple of jokes. And no one laughed. So I got off the stage and I, I sat in the front row because there was lots of spare, seats. lots of spare seats. And I and I and I, uh, Mister Mister Milky Monk, Milky Monk, thank you, Mister Milky Monk. Thank you for following. Uh, a good, good name, Mister Milky Monk. Yes. Yeah, so I told the joke. Uh, about a second or third joke, silence. So I, I got off the stage, sat in the front row in the, in the seat, and I went. <laughs> Uh, I got back up on the stage and, uh, and uh, carried on. Terrible, absolutely terrible. Uh, but then I got the space suit on and uh, I was much more relaxed and uh, and uh, haven't looked back. Anyway, I haven't looked uh, anywhere, any direction much. Um, if you if you could have five celebrities come and help you in your spaceship, who would you have and why? David Essex. Uh, David Essex. He would he would uh, just groom the fox, a little little comb, a little flea comb. He would just sit there. That'd be his job, just to sit there and do that. And uh, I've got to think of four more. Four more would be uh, the um, uh, what's a group a group of four. Uh, the the um, the. the the uh, maybe the Smiths could reform, and uh, no, we all, I wouldn't want Morris in the spaceship, though, would I? No, that's not gonna work. Um, four, four more people, just uh, uh, who should we have? We'll have um, can they be alive or dead? Can they be uh, you have your five celebrities come and help you in your spaceship? Who would they be, and why? Might have to come back to that, Harry Norman. I've got, I've, I've got David. David Essex is, is grooming the fox, uh, as they say. Harry Norman says it was very enjoyable. I've, I've lost track to what, what, what was it enjoyable? But is, is your hair so luscious due to coconut oil? Says Josie Ray. No, um, Josie Escapade swears by the coconuts, uh, and uh, she swears by lots of other fruit and vegetables as well, but. Uh, that's one place he swears. Um, five celebrities. I can't think of. I can't think of four more celebrities. Let's uh, uh, just pick pick four good comedians. Pick four good comedians, and they can all come up in the uh, spaceship with me. Four people who are, are funny and uh, and uh, and uh, we will we'll make each other laugh, can't we? We just have a laugh. Uh, Coconut, 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 coconut. Great music. Uh, I'm probably reading this chatting box far too far back. Uh, I really miss going to the video shop. Uh, yeah, it was. Uh, it was. Uh, uh, it was quite exciting. Apart from it's a bit annoying when you have to deliver them back by a certain time, otherwise they fine you or something. Uh, remember rightly. Beano or Dandy? It was uh, oh, about bloody hell. I'm not, I'm not, I've not seen either one of those for such a long time. Uh, I, I, I did used to get one of them. I can't. Maybe I've got both. I think I'm going to say Beano, but I'm not. I'm not I can't remember what's in what, which one now. Basil, what bone? I think I've, I listed my bones, broken bones. I've, I've scrolled. I've, I've need to scroll back. Um, gone too far back. I remember being a teddy boy. It lick lick cluck lick cluck. Uh, remembers being a teddy boy at three in 2010. Uh, I was I was a punk rocker. I was wasn't a, uh, I was the I was the Teddy Boy's enemy. Uh, is that Mr. Chicken Cluck Cluck's child? <laughs> little, little Cluck. Probably <laughs> sounds like it. Little Cluck. Yes, it is. It's Little Cluck. Little, little Cluck. 
Terraform, uh, De Terraform. Basil, do you prefer altar or ventricles? I only ask, as you said, the best questions come from the heart. Uh, excellent. Uh, and I, I'm going to go. I'm going to go for the uh, ventricles. The ventricles, uh, uh, lovely uh, bit of work. Basil with no skin. No, no, Josie Ray. Quite right. Uh, have you ever done? Uh, we are allowed to chat. Yes, chat. Quite right, Josie Ray. Chat. It's a. Uh, it's um. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh... Uh, if we can chat about anything, chat about anything uh, when it's called to chat. Uh, hi everyone. Hi, Mister Milky Monk. Uh, if I missed any, uh, I think I've missed a few more questions here. Hello, Milky Boy. Says uh, Harry Norman. Uh, I'd rather die. Uh, no, JC Page hasn't done stand up. She says she'd rather die. Although it's, that's going a bit too far. David Essex, David Bowie, David Edwards, David Earl. Yes, all the Davids. I have, have a crew of Davids, a full David crew. Larry David. How many ducks would it take to kill a hippo? It depends what you, how you, you go about it. Are the ducks attacking the hippo? Or are we going to just get a lot of ducks in a, uh, in a massive container and drop them on the hippo? Incoming recognition. B. One small step for man. One Plisk Pliskin. Pliskin 02. Pliskin 02. Thank you for fo following Pliskin 02. Welcome to uh, welcome to the, the dark side. One small and, uh, and man. One Big bogey M. Big bogey M. I mean bo bony M. Bony M. Big bogey M. Uh, ra ra Rasputin. Uh, thank you for following. Thank you, everyone who swallowed. Thank you very much. Uh, I think we've dealt with the ducks on the hippo, uh, sort of. Wagon Basil. Uh, what are your thoughts on Brexit? I, I've Brexited the entire fucking planet. I'm in space. I've Brexited myself, uh, although uh, I'd. Uh, I, I like I like I like things being joined together. I like um yeah uh, I like I like uh, uh not all individuals all together together in the in one the whole world as one coming together in a big sticky mess. Um, attack ducks, attack ducks. I reckon it would take uh, seventy seven to even uh, scratch him. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure that any amount. I suppose eventually enough ducks would do. Who would wear him down? Depends who got tired first. If the ducks could keep replenishing, like as the ducks got tired, more and more ducks could uh, join in. But you could be talking thousands. It'd be the most hideous uh, event ever held. I don't. I don't want to see. It. I just hope it never happens. Uh, one. One. <laughs> everyone says one. Uh, if it chokes on the duck. Uh, fair point. Could be one then. Could be the answer to that. Waffle ranks twenty four. <laughs> Bogey. Can duck? Uh, can ducks duck? Can ducks duck? I, I, uh, I think so. Just races Brexit. Uh, uh, that's enough. That's enough uh, to talk about that. When two become one. Uh, yes. Big bugger meant yes. Thank you, Mission Control. Oh, okay, big boy uh, can confirm. Big boy, uh, I, I shall. I think. Um, oh, Boney M. Boney M. We're talking about bonies and Boney M's. I'm not sure what's going on there. Boney, big boy M. I mean, Mission Control is dealing with uh, dealing with with all the uh, with all the what's this? Uh, all the questions. Quick sip of tea. I'm gonna I'm gonna play you. I'm gonna before we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stick on the. Uh, not played it for a while, have I? Not. I've not played. Um, uh, uh, what happened to Charlie? Charlie? Yes, Charlie's not called in for ages. Let's hope she calls back soon. <gasps> don't look! Don't look! Don't look! It's uh, it's uh, Johnny Depp. Never look! Never look at Johnny Depp. Look away. I'm gonna have to say I'm gonna have to say the words um, Jackie Chan three times. Hang on. Jackie Chan. 
Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan. Has it worked? Has it worked? There he is. Go on, Jackie. Go on, Jackie. Get him. In the nose. Go on, Jackie. Go on, Jackie. Go on, Jackie. Get him. Get him in the farm. Ah, he hates it in the farm. He hates it in the farm. He's, uh, he's, uh, oh, he's not liking it. He's, uh, he's getting worried. Hey, uh, thank you, thank you, uh, thank you very, very much, uh, Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan to the rescue. Uh. Uh, you sing the Post Malone, you just, just sing the Post Malone song. What's the Post Malone song? Looks like cuddly. I, f uh, I found YouTube videos of the baby hippo. I don't want to know anything about baby hippos and, uh, um, ducks, unlike their close relatives, swans, which are bigger and have a number of documented attacks on humans appear to be relatively harmless. Ducks are, ducks are rapists. But they don't ra rape people. Ducks uh, rape other ducks. Terrible. The sex life of ducks is a uh, oh, it's, it's, it's a it's a nightmare. Uh, duck and the hippo get on famously on that mattress brand. Oh, it does ring a bell. There is a mattress. Uh, uh, duck and the hippo. Yes, ducks and hippos. I think they get on fine. Don't know why we're worried about them. Let's stop worrying about ducks and hippos. They drown. Uh, they drown their. Lovers, they drown their lovers. It's a bloody horrendous uh, uh, life for a duck. I mean, they they look calm when they fly on the water, but underneath the water, there's a massive rape going on somewhere. That's ducks for you. Let's uh, hang on, let's go there. Let's just find something here. Uh, the pygmy hippo house at London Zoo has a rather splendid aroma. Very Pungent but strangely appealing, uh, says uh, Drefon. Am I saying that right? Drefon, 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 Drefon. Sorry if I'm getting it wrong. Probably am. Let's have a fact of the stream. Says Waffle. Uh, is this herpes free? Uh, now, something about how Herp is free. Herp is, well, is it now Herp is free? F thank you very much for following. I've had loads of followers today. Very, very, uh, very kind of you to all uh, uh, follow. Been fairly quiet, uh, quiet, um, been a fairly quiet night tonight, really. Um, but it's been lovely to, uh, now, now Herp is free. Oh, now, I should have guessed that. Thanks. Stay hydrated, homie. Thank you very much. Uh, now, I hope I'll have a, I'll have a, I've got a glass of water here. Getting hydrated. Big ups for being herpes free. Mm. Right. I think it's time. Uh, I'll be doing. I'll be doing. I'm back on Spreaker very soon. Very back on Spreaker. I don't know when. It could be any time. Back on Spreaker. So if you fancy listening to me on Spreaker, uh, so you've got a website. My website, basilbutler.com. Uh, it's easy to remember. Basilbutler.com. Go there and uh, it gives you... And look up all the links and all the stuff on there. It's all sorts of shit there. You can find out... Don't they? Give spiral winkies. Yes, I think so. Have you got only fans, Basil? Have you got OnlyFans? OnlyFans. What does OnlyFans mean, uh, Mr. Milky Monk? Uh, I'm, not, um, I'm not sure. Have you got OnlyFans? I don't know what I've got. I don't know what I've got, uh, uh, Mr. Milky Monk. I've got some sprouts, and I've got some potatoes, and I've got a uh, menagerie. And I'm stuck in the bloody spaceship. Uh, that's what I've got. Yeah, basilbottler.com. Mission Controls put the... Uh, if you go there, it's got all the links, and you can f you can find out about my Spreaker show. It's got phone numbers there, and it's got websites, and it's got... Uh, I don't know what it's got. It's got all sorts of stuff. I should go and have a look at it, shouldn't I? I, I made the bloody thing, and I've forgotten about it. Anyway, for everybody... Uh, can we add... Uh, Mia Kalafa to the show? Who's that? I don't know who that is. 
I'm not very good on uh, knowing who anyone is, to, to be honest. Uh, uh, big boy, I'm 65. Uh, all right, so what I'm going to do, it's, uh, so, so yeah, so look, listen out for the Spreaker. Spreaker shows on uh, on Spreaker. All the details on my uh, website, and uh, I've listened to that for a change. This is for, um, I forgot to do this earlier, for everybody who's uh, followed or done anything else, uh, whatever, bits, and I, I think it's mostly followers today. Anyway, everyone who's followed, anyway, anyone's, anyone's gotten involved in any way at all, really. This is for you, this is for all of you. Axel. Axel, zero three zero. Thank you very much for following. Thank you, thank you very much indeed. Yes, several follow kiss, kiss for Axel as well, uh, and, and everybody else who's uh, followed. It's lovely getting new followers. Uh, uh, I had herpes once. Haven't been the same since. I don't know. I've never. I, I don't think I've had. Oh, no, you know, you, you know when you've had herpes. Uh, pretty soon I've got herpes. Don't uh, I think it's fine. I've got crabs though, apparently, or I might have the crabs or oh, fleas. Couldn't work out what it was. You are you streaming tomorrow, uh, Basil? No, I'm streaming again, Mr. Milky Monk. I don't think so. I don't plan to. I don't stream that much, there's not much demand for it. But I'm streaming again on Sunday at 5 30. Uh, I, I haven't got enough plastic numbers. To, so I, I've uh, improvised. I've improvised there. Basil's secret. Uh, where's the switch? Yeah, it turns on. Basil's secret underground dark stream. Thursdays at nine and Sundays at five five thirty. I sometimes do one out of the blue. So if you get notification, make sure you've got notifications if you if you're following, and then they'll you'll, you'll pop up, and then you get excited and. Uh, uh, so I watch Basil. Oh no, I mean, it was all right once, but I've gone off the idea. Watch him again. Uh, but you could always try Spreaker. Uh, I'm doing I'm doing Spreaker. I play can play music on Spreaker, so it's uh, it makes a nice uh, makes a nice change because you can't really play stuff on here. Thank you for asking about uh, my next stream, uh, Basil. Can you have my kids? Uh, have them? Uh, uh, you, do you mean you've got kids and you want me to look after them, or you want me to impregnate you? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't fancy either one uh, particularly, to be honest. Uh, Axel, one minute, is this a certified Corona mask? What, you, what you're wearing or what I'm wearing? Oh, it, I don't know. This is my face. I don't know. I, I, I've got. I don't know where it's gone. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Uh, that's not there. That's not there. there it is. There's me. Uh, normal, normal sort of mask. Just wear the same things everyone else. Although I do also sometimes just wear a lot of um, colored lights around the mask because because uh, coronavirus is it, it's boring. It just brightens the day up a little bit. Uh, Looks, uh, looks lovely. Looks lovely, boy. Anyway, it's time to go now. I'll be back on. I'll be back. So look out for my Spreaker show. Uh, I'll probably do that. Uh, I might do one before Sunday. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just uh, uh, leave you with a song. I'm gonna, sing, I'm gonna sing a song. Can't play any music because, um, because um, the Twitch don't allow it. Well, they, they, I can't play any anyway. Much, much uh, love, Basil. Take care. Take care, everybody. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Thanks, especially everyone who's uh, followed. Uh, it's lovely to get lots of new uh, faces. Thank you for the stream. Uh, big love. Thank, thank you all. Uh, see you again on Sunday, hopefully. Uh, half past, about half past five. I like all of you, says Becky Miz. I like all of you, Becky Miz. 
Um, let's uh, buy Ellie Brizo. Thank you, thank you all for uh, watching. It's not, it's not been that exciting today. Sorry about that. Uh, it's been a, uh, it's been a tired, a busy week. I had all sorts of trouble with the uh, sprouts. Uh, I'll see you all uh, uh, either on Spreaker or on back on the here in the spaceship on the Sunday. Sunday half past five. Bit of, bit of David Essex. Bit of David Essex. As we all go off into the night, back into our big bed. Uh, I'll be back. Uh, Dazzle, you seem lovely. Everyone stay awesome. Thank you very much, uh, Axel030. And eyes, uh, eyes, uh, nice. Thank you very much, everybody. I'll see you on Sunday. I'm back on here, back in space. Let's have a bit of David Essex to uh, send us all to sleep. The nights are colder now. Maybe I should close the door. And anyway, the snow has covered all your footsteps, and I can follow you no more. The fire still burns at night My memories are warm and clear But everybody knows It's hard to be alone at this time of year It was only a winter's tale Just another winter's tale And why should the world take notice of one more love that's failed It's a love that could never be Though it meant a lot to you and me On a worldwide sway I sway them On a worldwide sway It's just another winter's tale I'll tune up for Sunday, uh, Sir Jessica Spades while I stand alone, a bell is ringing far away. I wonder if you hear, I wonder if you're listening, I wonder where you are today. Good luck, I wish you well, for all that wishes may be worth. I hope that love and strength are with you for the length of your time on earth. Right, there go. Uh, right, we go. Here we go, everybody. Oh shit! Me pictures, me, uh, me lyrics are gone haywire. Hang on a second. That's fucked it, isn't it? Uh, I should know the words anyway. It was only a winter's tale, everybody. Just another winter's tale. And why should the world take notice of one more love that's failed? You don't get this on Twitch anywhere else. It's a love that could never be, not that you want it, though it meant a lot to you and me. On a worldwide scale, we're just another winter's tale. Thank you very much. Uh, where's, where's the uh, where's the applaud? Where's the applaud effects? I've got one somewhere. There we are. See you on Sunday.